um, a very very good day to you all great twelves. um welcome back um, to our lesson video today we're going to be discussing organic chemistry um particularly writing down the structural formulas of certain compounds that we are going to be dealing with today in each and every homologous series okay so the question of today says um says question says write down the structural formula 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 of okay of these following compounds so the very first compound that we are going to be dealing with it's um hexane hexane second one write down the structural formula for ethanol for ethanol for heptanoic acid egg acid the following um, two butanol two butanol three pentanol three pentanol two promo hexane two promo hexane one fluoropropane one fluoropropane hexanol hexanol ethanoic acid ethanoic acid pendanoic acid one butane three butane and two pending so today we're going to be writing the structural formulas for all of these um, organic um, compounds that you have listed here okay so let's start with the very first one okay hexane okay start with hexane okay Oh yes, let's start with um, hexane. Hexane. Okay, let's start with the structural formula for hexane. Okay, guys. So mind you, hexane. Okay, hexane is under our case. Okay. Yes, as you can see, the suffix there a. Okay. Yes. So the homologous series that this uh organic command belongs to or belongs under its arcanes so we have six c atoms okay as you can see the prefix hex hex means six we have c carbon atoms okay yes so and the general formula for for arcanes it's cn h2n plus two okay so we're going to have how many c's six c's hex means six one two three four five six okay how many H's C N H two N plus two H two N plus two so this will buy six um 
2 multiplied by 6 that is going to be 12 plus 2 it's 14 so we're going to have 14 ages here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 yes that's how it goes um yes so we have six carbon atoms and 14 hydrogen atoms okay yes so that's for for example let's move to to the following compound so let's go straight to ethanol okay let's write here ethanol ethanol okay yes for our second compound um in our list so at means two and on the suffix this base column is that this organic compound belongs under ketones meaning that we're going to have two c's okay yes so the the functional group for 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 ketones yes we have o okay yes the oxygen atom so the oxygen is going to bond with the very first o and have our h there have our h h h okay as you know that the general formula is cn h2 n o2 o i mean so sorry not a o2 so cn h2 n that's a general formula for for ketones for ketones so that's this is this is the structural formula for ethanol okay yes yes so again please so again please um don't confuse um ketones with the other eyes yes i know they belong on the same functional group but the o as well as the their general formula looks the same um yes so as well as their o bond this o bond on the ketones is going to be inside okay as you can see it's inside there the, the the compound okay yes but if it was all that it was going to be outside okay yes it was to it was going to be ethanol it, if it was aldehyde it was going to be ethanol ethanol which was going to be like this one two okay our o was going to be outside okay so this is ethanol okay please don't confuse the two as you see in the diagram that um, instead of writing the 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 correct one there as you can see in the in the uh, on, on our diagram um i made a mistake there um yes i draw for all the items instead of instead of ketones so this is the right one these are the ketones okay yes um so please don't don't confuse the two and so on the following one it's heptanoic acid write it here it's heptanoic acid so it's it's heptanoic acid um okay um i think i can restart this okay okay is heptanoic acid okay so for heptanoic acid for heptanoic acid this is hept um hept means seven we have to have seven c atoms noic a 
acid. This is like the carboxylic group. So I have seven C atoms. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so we have seven C atoms. So the general formula for carboxylic acids, it's CN H two N O two. Okay, yes. So CNH two N O two means yeah, that we have extra two oxygen atoms. Okay, so meaning that we are going to have how many H's? We're going to have um, fourteen H's and two O atoms. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Okay, we have O here and we have OH. Okay, and we have OH. Okay. Yes, so let's count our H atoms. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Our C, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So that's how it goes. So this is heptanoic acid and the carboxylic group. Okay, yes. These are the carboxylic acids. Okay, um, let's move to the following one. So we have two butanol. This is alcohol, this is an alcohol. Okay, so the general formula for alcohols it's CN H2N plus one O H um two butanol. So meaning that you have four C atoms. Put means four. No, this is an alcohol as I said. All. Okay, the suffix there. Okay, let's do it like this. So, um, we have two butter. So sorry, we have two. Butanol. So we have two butanol. One, two, three, four. Okay. So how many ages that we are supposed to have? Mm, we're going to have ten ages. Okay. Ten ages. Okay. It's two on the second one. One, two. Okay. The branch of the OH bond is going to be on the second C atom. This is. Okay, let me put it. Um, let me put it underneath so that we can see it. Okay. O H one two three four five six seven eight nine ten yes that's how it goes so this is two butanol or oh, yes that's how it goes this is two butanol so let's move to three pentanol okay so you can see Three pentanol there. Three pentanol. I think we can have a space here. Three pentanol. So now we have three pentanol. Again, these are the alcohols. Okay, these are the alcohols. Um, you can see pent means five we are going to have five c atoms under alcohols okay ol 
the suff the 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 suffix which is oyal. This belongs to the Omega series which are alcohols. Okay, so five, one, two, three, four, five. And the branch that three means the branch of the OH bond and the alcohols it's going to be on the third C atom. Okay. Eight, two, three, four, five. And mind you, um, the general formula for alcohols it's CN HTN plus one. So here I'm going to have um, 12 ages or 12 hydrogen atoms. So this other H, I'm going to write it underneath. Okay, the OH bond, it's here. Okay, the OH bond, it's here. And the third one. Two. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So we're having twelve age atoms. Okay. Yes. So still moving. Um, I think we can also use this side um, to write down. Okay, so we have two bromohexane. So we have. Okay, let me just say this so that we don't get disturbed. Okay, so we have two bromohexane. Exane, have two bromexane. For two bromexane, we're going to have um, okay, these are the halogens. As you can see, that we have a halogen which is bromine, okay, in okay, yes, so these are the halogens. Um, these are the halo arcanes. Okay, yes. So the halogen, which is bromine, is going to be on the second. Okay, it's going to lie on the second C atom. Okay, so this two bromohexane, which is six C atoms, hex means six. Four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. So we have one, two, three. Mind you, promo is going to be here. So we're going to have PR here, okay? We're going to have PR. So the general formula. For 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 alloy canes, it's Cn H two N plus one and the halogen. Okay, yes, Cn H two N plus one. So here we're going to have um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so twelve plus one plus one H. It's going to be 13 so we're supposed to have 13 ages here okay so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen yes so this is two promo hexane this is the structural formula okay Yes, so let's move um, to one fluoropropane. Let's move to one fluoropropane. 
let's move to one floral propane one floral propane this is the another this is another hello okay okay yes so this is another okay as you can see the halogen there which is fluorine okay so fluorine is on the very first C atom okay yes so that halogen lies on the very first C atom as you can see one propane okay prop means three one two three mind you the general formula for halogen CN H2N plus one in the halogen so here we're going to have five H's okay yes H2N plus one um, no not seven I think okay let's substitute CN C3 uh, H six plus one seven yes we're going to have seven H's um, so this is our fluorine okay this is our fluorine this is our F this is our H this is our H this is our H our H our H each item 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 yes so that's how it goes as you can see our fluorine is on the very first C atom 1, 2, 3 okay yes so let's move to hexanol hexanol these are the aldehydes so hexanol of hexanol of hexanol okay so for hexanol Hexanol, um, hex means six. We are having six C atoms under this compound, and homologous um, three is called aldehyde. So we are having six C atoms. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. The functional group is. O, okay, yes, it has a oxygen atom that is bonding with the 1C. So the general formula of um, aldehydes is CnH2NO, okay, yes. So O is going to probably outside here in the last C atom, okay. So it's going to be here in the last C atom. So, have one. So, how many H's are we going to have? Um, H to N. Oh, okay. So, we're going to have um, 12 H's. Eh? Yes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11 12 okay yes so these are the these are the other eyes so let's count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 are supposed to be 12 12 yes so we have 12 ages 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 yes c and h to n because we have how many six sixes so 2n h to n is a six um it's 12 so we have 12 right 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 
1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. No. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yes, so that is correct. Okay. Yes, as you can see. Yes. Um, let's move to ethanoic acid. Let's move to ethanoic acid. Let's move to ether. Ethanoic acid. Okay. Ethanoic acid, these um, are carboxylic acids and a carboxylic group. Okay, yes. So the general formula for carboxylic acid it's Cl H2N O2. Okay. So earth meaning that you have two C's two C atoms. Okay. Yes. So meaning that it's C N H um two N O two. Um so we're going to have four H's here. So this is one this is two this is three and this is our O this is O H okay yes so this is our age so let's count one two three four we have four H's yes one two ethanoic acid so this is ethanoic acid okay yes um mm, out of space let me just um grab another board for us yes yeah, so we have we left with pentanoic acid one butane three butane and two pentene okay so let's start with pentanoic acid so the structure formula for pentanoic acid so this is under carboxylic acid again okay yes the halomega series so um as you can see the oic acid okay yes um yes so we're having five one two three four five c's five c atoms the general formula for the carboxylic acid is CN H2N O2, just to remind you. Okay, so we have, meaning that you are going to have um, 10 H's here. 10 H atoms, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, eight nine this the last one bonds with o and the remaining bonds o h okay yes so that's how it goes so we have here one two three four five five c's that's correct so let's count our age if they are um 10 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 ages that's correct so let's move to one butane let's move to one butane just write it here one one butane Okay, so this is under meaning that in this uh, compound we have four put means for four carbon atoms, and that it belongs under alkynes. 
okay the omega series meaning that um, the general form is going to be cn h2n minus 2 so 1 2 3 4 so cn h2n so 8 minus 2 6 we're going to have six ages here six h atoms okay so um one butane that one means that the triple bond is going to be on the very first c atom okay yes it's going to be here the triple bond meaning that mind you guys this is alkynes okay alkynes have a triple bond while alkenes have double bond and alkenes a single bond meaning that this is unsaturated hydrocarbon okay yes so let's count let's have our our c's or h's so one two three four five six so this is our this is our one butane okay this is our one butane one butane okay so let's move um to the second last compound okay so that is three butane three butane three butane so we have um going to have four c atoms okay this is the same hallmark series as one butane but different position of the of the triple bond okay yes so now the triple bond is, is going to be on the third c atom one two three here Okay. Okay, so we started counting this side, okay? Yes. So one. So we're going to have um six ages. Six age atoms. One, two, three, four, five. Mm, yes, six. Yes, that's how it goes. So this is three time. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four C atoms. So on the third one, we have a triple bond. Okay, that's what is meant by this three I had there okay so the last the last um okay I think you can see the okay so the last compound that we are going to be writing down its structural formula it's going to be two pentine okay so two pentine this this is under alkenes, okay, homogas series. As you can see, in pentene, in, okay. Pent means five. We are going to have. Let me write it here. Let me just say like this. Say pentene. It's two pentene. Yes. So, meaning that the two, um, which is our prefix, just before our prefix, by the way, um, it's, it means that the double bond, it's on the second C atom, okay, on this compound, one, we're going to have five C atoms, pent means five. 
three, four, five. Okay. Okay. Two. Okay. So the general formula for 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 alkenes it's C N H two N. Yes. So it ends there. C N H two N meaning that we're going to have um twa twa ten ten C uh H I terms here. So the double bond is going to be here. Okay. Yes, so going to have one here. Yeah. So we can count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Um, can say since this one, one, two lies there. Yes. So that's how it goes. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yes. So these double bonds. Therefore, this C atom. Okay. Yes, or oh, we can take this H to here, to be like this, okay, yes, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, that's correct, um, that's the end of the lesson um, for today, please um, don't forget to subscribe, please subscribe, subscribe guys, Please click that red button, subscribe, subscribe um, onto this channel so that you can grow. Um, hope you have a great and wonderful productive day. See you in the next following video. Cheers.